<laughs> As Jamaicans, we say you have to turn your hand, make fashion, right? It's a very real phrase for many of us, especially since this pandemic. It's not a joke. So one Jamaican woman in particular, Shade Smith, has used her hands to craft some of the most beautiful accessories for us. Um, so ladies, she's here in studio to talk to us about some of the things that we can wear and look beautiful doing it. Shade Smith, owner of By Shade is here using what is in her hand. Her skin pretty, man. Punch up again, Prince. G Thank you. Zum. You need to give me the skincare routine before you go. Oh, good genius. Um, maybe that should be your next line of product. Right? <laughs> wink, wink. But you're a teacher by profession. Yes, I am. And you've been teaching for how long? Uh, less than a year. I okay. just started teaching because I graduated from UA last year. Gotcha. So how did this come about? How did crochet come to be a thing? A couple of years ago, I actually bought a crochet slippers from someone and I was like, this is so beautiful. I need to learn how to do this. And I learned how to do it, but I wasn't interested in making slippers. What do you mean you learned how to do it? You just, you just learned how to do it? I read books and watch I watched YouTube, YouTube mm -hmm. of course, mm -hmm. and then trial and error a lot of And that. how long ago was it? Uh, about five years ago. Okay. Okay. So how long did it take right. you to learn? Because you have basic and then you mm -hmm. have this. Okay. <laughs> To get at this level, uh, I could say maybe two years, uh, but I wasn't doing all of this. I never challenged myself mm -hmm. until like last year. So you, so you, so you bought the, the kit, you learned how to do it. Yes. Um, and then you were like, you know, this could be a business. Yes, because I used to make things for myself and my friends. And then somebody saw me in something. I was like, where did you get that? And I was like, oh, I made it. And they're like... Make it for me too. So I was mm -hmm. like, okay, no problem. Mm -hmm. So that's where it started, where I started to make it for other persons and say, well, let's expand it into a business. And what did you start with? What product was your first product? My first product was a bikini. I made it for myself. <laughs> and I don't really make bikinis anymore. Why? Why? Because I want to try a lot of other things. You but know? I don't mean you have to stop making bikini. And no, if somebody orders it, yeah, of course I'm going to make it. You know, Shadi, I've always had a question about crochet bikinis. Like, do they stay up? Yes, they I do. I mean, when they get wet, do they pull apart? No. I mean, they stay up. They're pretty firm. You have to make it very right. tight. Yes, you have oh. to make them tight. And you have to make the straps thick enough that it gives you support and right. doesn't dig into your skin. Right. You line it? Sometimes, if okay. the person requests it, some persons don't, don't really okay. care. So bikinis by Shade, if you're interested, because summer is coming and a lot of us are working on our summer body. Right. 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 Okay, but let's talk through some of the other things. First thing that caught my eye was, was um, this. And I was bags. like, oh, wait, these are bags. Yes. So talk to me a little bit about the concept. It's very unique, Shade. I don't think I've ever seen anything like it. Thank you. So I actually saw the acrylic circles. Um, I believe I was on Pinterest or something. And I was like, those circles, I can use them. So I experimented. I tried like maybe four or five designs before I first I sold my first one. Mm -hmm. So even after that, I kept modifying the design until I got it to a place where I like it. Okay. And many persons also love it. What do you call this one? Your... This is the Primera bag. Oh, the Primera? Yes. Okay, because it's, it's your Primera product? Yes, it's okay. the first of its kind. Ah, comprendo. How long does it take you to make this? Because this is at, I mean, this is no joke. The way you've lined it. It's a couple hours. Uh, that's it? Yeah, I just watch a movie and hmm. I get it done. Hmm, nothing serious, just cock up my foot. I've gotten much faster. That's that's the thing. Mm -hmm. I'm able to crochet very, very fast. So this is your best seller? Yes, okay. at the moment. Okay. And then this is a top. Let me yes, show you it how is this a works. top. It is a top, everybody. Trust me on this. <laughs> Tell me how this works now, lady. Okay, so the parts that you're holding here, that's the back. Mm -hmm. This is the front. Mm -hmm. It's kind of like a little peekaboo mm -hmm. design. Well, it's a lot of peekaboo. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Wait. And um, perfect for the summer. Yes. You know, because time hot. That so, pair of shorts or right, nice jeans. Or a nice, I wear it with jeans. Mm -hmm. So I'm not into the short shorts that mm -hmm. much, but it looks so wonderful with jeans. And imagine it's a cute top. Okay, and then what is this, Shade? That is, you know, those are the halo crowns that persons mm -hmm. use for photo shoots and stuff. 
I actually made that for my own photo shoot. Did and you? I think I made this, I made this yesterday. We need to see some, sure. <laughs> need to see some pictures of the actual clothes and how you, how you stuff translate. This is lovely. And then talk to me about these pieces now. Okay, know. these are roses, they are flowers, rose mm -hmm. and lavender. Mm -hmm. um, I made these over the weekend as well mm -hmm. for a photo shoot. I used these and I was like, these are perfect to show like the versatility of crocheting. And the intricacy of your work. Right. Miss. Oh my gosh. This is really good stuff. All right, so you're, you're gonna try and teach me or are you just gonna show me? I'm gonna try and teach you. No man, we don't have the time for that. <laughs> we could try anyway and see what goes. All right, so I put your hook right there. This is my hook. Yes. Gotcha. And you're gonna have the string. So my string. you hold it like this. I hold it like this. And this. you wrap it around your finger. Yes. You carry it around, almost like you're gonna make a knot. Okay. But you're not pulling it fully through. Gotcha. So you hold on to the middle here mm -hmm. and hold both ends. Georgia, you lost me for a minute. I know when you lost me. <laughs> Let's go again. Yes. So yeah. wrapping around. Yeah. Pretend like you're making a knot, yeah. a simple knot, right? But instead of carrying it all the way through, you just okay. pull the middle here. Okay, gotcha. And, and, you? and pull both ends. Pull. So you have the shorter end here yeah. and the longer end. Uh, look like we're getting there. Uh, yeah, man, that's it. All right, all right. So that is a slip knot. Okay. And that's the starting of most crochet works. Gotcha. So you're going to pull it so down a pull little. Down here, so you're yeah, pull, pull down the short right. end. <coughs> right. Mm -hmm. And you're going to take the hook now. Yes, and turn the hook portion up. Yes, and you put it through the hole. So my hole needs to be a little smaller because yours is small. Yeah. Okay. It's copy. Yes, and then you extend the long portion. You're going to forget about the short one for okay. now. Okay. Like this, and then you scoop. So you push it under. Under. And you grab it with the hook and pull it through the hole. Wait, wait, wait. Let me drop out again. So, so scoop under. Mm -hmm. And pull, pull it, it through down. the hole. Okay. Or oh, pull it through the through hole. Through the hole. I'm going to scrap it what you're doing. <laughs> That's okay. Wait. Push it under. Yes. <clears throat> under here. Mm -hmm. And then how? And you pull it through. Through this hole? Yes. I mean, you can use it and just. Pull it over it if you want. Uh, this is going to take a whole day. <laughs> Some but person says it's very difficult to start. Yeah. I think the most difficult thing is starting. Sit there. You pull it through? Yeah. Perfect. You made your first stitch, your first chain. It's called a chain. The only chain I really want to. And then you continue the making chains, making chains until you form I something. I cannot imagine how you do it. Well, I mean, I guess. The degree of difficulty is in the learning, right? Yes. Because this yes. is the first time. But to think that you do that, I mean, this top will take you like how long to make? Three hours. No, sir. Lady, yes. you're going with yourself. So what is the dream for the business? You're building out. What else are you going to do? What other I products? I want to expand it. I want to eventually get a store. You see Crochet by Shadi. I'll have an array of crochet items, you know, for now. I'll just work with online and I get my orders and stuff. Um, I recently got an order um, for a skirt set and I'm so excited to make it mm -hmm. because that's exactly where I want to take the business. So neck passion to me. <laughs> so where do we order from you? Okay, you can order from me on Facebook at Crochet by Shade or on Instagram at by Shade. All right. Guys, she's a teacher. So she's using that gift, but she also has this in yes. her hands, so creativity in spades. Thank you very much, Teach. Appreciate it. Shade Thank you so Smith, much for having me. Owner of Buy Shade. If you're into crochet, you want that bikini, or as Nev would say, bikini, <laughs> for your summer body, or you just want a nice cute top, or a nice bag to just throw your Saturday stuff in. Jody, I see you in this, actually. Um, but people say, but Shade, what if I don't want people see, to see inside my bag? And everything in there. Then I have little pouches that you can buy. You can choose the size that you want. 
and you put it in. This one is big enough, can hold my phone. Okay. So put it just, in and just, and just drop it in. it in the bag. Nice. All right. Jory can actually fit in the bag, Prince. You are not, you are not joking. <laughs> I mean, whoever said it, it's a fact. Joe, mm -hmm. come and fit in the bag. Thank you, thank you, Shelly. So Jodie over there, you know so she can fit in the bag? Oh, is she small enough? I'm telling you. Anyway, good things come in small packages. Girls in ICT Day with Flo is next. Thank you, Shelly. I know the best to you. Thank Stay you so tuned, much everybody. We'll be right back.